We've been testing Bayer's new herbicide Matino Complete in wheat and barley as part of an extensive broadacre trial program, including small plot replicated, as well as large area grower applied trials. I'm Tim Murphy, Bayer's Market Development Agronomist for South Australia. Today, I'm here at one of our Matino Complete barley trials at Giles Corner in the state's mid-north. Matino Complete is registered for the use at the incorporated by sowing use timing in barley at the rate of 750 mils per hectare. With excellent control of annual ryegrass, barley grass, silvergrass and toad rush, it's a powerful tool for weed control where the options for barley growers are currently fairly limited. I want to explain to you today the points to think about when using Matino Complete in barley and what to keep in mind with regards to achieving optimum crop safety. Recommended seeding systems for barley will be limited to knife point press wheel. Disc seeding systems will not be recommended with barley. As is the case with quite a few other herbicides, the margin for safety with Matino Complete in barley is narrower than that in wheat. This means that while significant crop effect is not normally expected in barley, where Matino Complete is used as per label directions, occasionally we'll see more substantial crop effects that can persist for longer into the cropping season and the potential for causing yield reduction. So where would we expect to see more crop effect? And more importantly, what can we do to avoid it? Well, after rigorous testing of Matino Complete in barley over a large number of trials around Australia, just like this one here behind me, we can provide some clear guidance to the grower on how to minimise the potential of crop effect. Crop effect tends to be greater when either a high intense rainfall event follows soon after seeding of barley, causing the treated soil to move into the crop row or if soaking rainfall during the early stages of the growing season causes the movement of product into that crop root zone. There are a few important measures that can be taken that may reduce the movement of product into this crop seed zone. Whilst the label allows for seeding up to seven days after the application of Matino Complete, barley should be seeded as soon as practical after the product has been sprayed. We should also avoid using Matino Complete in barley in dry seeding situations. When sowing, avoid throwing treated soil into adjacent crop rows, leaving furrows open, and avoid shallow seeding depths. Crop effects can be exasperated by factors that affect crop root growth. This can involve things like root disease, waterlogging, poor nutrition, soil compaction, poor seed quality or other herbicides. So, when using Matino Complete in barley, apply it alone, avoid using it in a soil prone to waterlogging and use good quality barley seed that hasn't been treated with seed treatment that may shorten the coliole or delay seed emergence. I'm now in a large area grower trial up the road at Auburn where the grower has applied Matino Complete four hours before seeding his Spartacus barley using a knife point press wheel seeding system. This paddock has had good moisture at application and in the weeks following. It's now 12 weeks since seeding and there has been 235 mils of in-crop rainfall. And you can see that we have a good healthy barley crop here. This is a high pressure annual ryegrass site and as I walk through the treated area, you can see that the annual ryegrass control has been really good, apart from some escapes where the weeds have emerged in the furrow. In terms of crop safety, I visited four weeks after seeding and we did see some evidence of minor bleaching in the early weeks after crop emergence, predominantly in the area where the root growth has been compromised, for example, in the trafficked compacted areas. Now at 12 weeks from seeding, we can still see some minor bleaching effects remaining, but the crop is generally growing well and looking good. And with the level of weed control we're seeing here, we'd expect a really good positive yield response. So to wrap up, Matino Complete provides a really valuable tool for growers to achieve an outstanding pre-emergent grass weed control in barley. 
There are some important guidelines to follow in order to maximise crop safety. And if these are followed, then along with a high level of weed control, we can expect some fantastic yield results in barley. If you'd like more information, search Matino Complete or get in contact with your local bar representative.